So, the TSI Assessment 2.0, what should you expect? Here are the main things you should know about the test. The TSIA2 measures your strengths and weaknesses in mathematics as well as reading and writing. The results are used as an indicator of how ready you are for college-level courses. The TSIA2 includes two placement tests, mathematics and English language arts and reading. The TSIA2 mathematics test contains about 20 multiple choice questions that cover quantitative reasoning, algebraic reasoning, geometric and spatial reasoning, and probabilistic and statistical reasoning. Personal calculators are not permitted, but don't panic. You will have access to an on-screen calculator during the test. The TSIA2 English Language Arts and Reading Test, or ELAR, contains about 30 multiple choice questions that cover text synthesis and analysis, and content revisions and editing for conventions. The ELAR test may also require you to write a persuasive essay. No dictionaries are allowed, but you will get to use scratch paper to plan your essay. Depending on your score on the classification tests, you may be given a diagnostic test with additional questions to get deeper insight into your skills. A few more things you need to know about the test. It's multiple choice. It's computer adaptive, which means that questions get easier or harder depending on how you respond. It's not timed. It can take anywhere from one to five hours, so don't sweat it. Remember, your score will determine your future classes, so take as much time as you need to complete each question. Once the assessment is done, you will immediately receive your score report, and this will help your advisor place you in the right courses for your abilities and your major. Be sure to review your entire report. The information provided will help you understand your academic strengths and areas for improvement or help you prepare to retake the TSIA2 if you want. And that's it. Feel better? If you're nervous, the best way to calm yourself is to study. The skills you learn while studying for the TSIA2 will be useful in your future career. If you go into the medical field, or art and media, or business administration, or culinary arts and hospitality, these skills will be used every day. Performing well on the TSIA2 is important, so make sure you're prepared. Good luck!